Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Libra. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of November 30th through December 5th. This is like a weekly reading, and it's for you and the other person, okay? So we're just going to see what comes up. Keep in mind that not every reading is for you. So what do we have for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for them and the other person? Somebody that you're dealing with, it may not be exactly who you're asking about because it's going to be the energy that is most prominent okay seven of pentacles reversed now this is your column their column and the overall energy of course these columns can be reversed so two of swords reversed seven of pentacles reversed two of swords reversed a decision is being made seeing the truth lies being exposed um opening your eyes uh, no longer investing in something Hmm. Nine of Wands. Nine of Wands. So this is challenge. Challenge. Being challenged. You're going to be challenged this week. Whether whether it's time to go or not. Because the Seven of Pentacles is whether it's time to go. But it's reversed. This is unrealistic. Very dissatisfied with somebody's choice. You may be dissatisfied with somebody's choice to leave. Okay? that could be the case because I consider the seven, pen, seven of Pentacles a relocation card but this is dissatisfied with a choice um, very very weary I feel like you're going to be facing some challenges this week and I think it's they're painful, tre stressful challenges. Something is stressful. You are being stressed out over a situation. This is seeing the truth. Overwhelmed. Definitely overwhelmed. I feel like there's some sort of overwhelmed here. Being overwhelmed. Four of Pentacles reversed. Now this is your column, this is their column. Five of Wands reversed. The Queen of Pentacles reversed. You could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Doesn't have to be. But there's definitely going to be a conflict. You're dealing with somebody that is struggling. Uh, there could be some power struggles here, but there's definitely going to be a change. Four of Pentacles, that is letting go, opening up, giving. Uh, done fighting done somebody's done fighting but you do have a, somebody here that is very greedy very selfish very obsessed you got an obsessive obsessed somebody that is obsessed with money here okay so i'm not sure who this person is but somebody that is obsessed they are obsessed with money they are obsessed they're jealous um Five of Wands reversed. Now, I, the Five of Wands reversed is some sort of uh, maybe finding a solution or there's some sort of confrontation. There could also be a full-scale battle here. Somebody could be battling. You're dealing with a selfish individual, a very, very selfish individual that wants money. That Four of Pentacles, Four, four of Pentacles about money. Okay, it's about stability. It's about security. It's about wanting all the money, not wanting to give the money, needing to give money. There's something to do with money here. You're dealing with a selfish, money-hungry individual by the looks of things. Um, all about the money. Four of Pentacles reversed. Now that is opening up, giving and sharing, perhaps, um, but having a hard time. We have somebody here that is very obsessed extremely obsessed obsessed with money so I don't know who the hell you're dealing with but it, it feels like this is very stressful um, patience 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 is needed somebody may be after your money but I, I feel like they um, well they're definitely challenging you you're gonna be challenged by an individual who um, isn't very nice. Now, I'm not sure if you work with this person. You could work with this person. Could be somebody that you, maybe it's at school or something like that. Um, there's some sort of insecurities here. 
for the queen. Lazy. You got a lazy person around you. Somebody that is very lazy, very selfish, very greedy. Fighting. Fighting for money or fighting for stability. Fighting for something. Now this is the overall outcome. Three of Wands reverse. Not working together very well. Not on the same page. So I, there's going to be some sort of the hermit. A need to withdraw. A need to go within. Need time to reflect. You are going to need time to reflect on something that is happening this week. There's going to be a lack of working together. A lack of teamwork. A lack of... of uh, togetherness. Somebody is not on the same page. You are not on the same page as another person. You're dealing with somebody that is a bully. Somebody that is very, very stubborn. This person is uh, very, very greedy and selfish. They do not want to give. They want to keep it all for themselves. Seven of Pentacles reversed. That is investment. Unrealistic. This is unrealistic. This is a poor choice you're going to you're going to see something very very clearly that probably makes you very very angry i think that you're going to get angry this week by the looks of things i mean that looks angry to me so i i feel like i feel like you could definitely be put in a position where you get angry and you need to control yourself you're going to need to control your anger um you're dealing with somebody who is extremely selfish um it's like a wicked witch. You're dealing with a wicked witch of some sort. Um, this person doesn't care less. Does not care less about you. Whoever this person is. All they care about is holding on to what they got. And I feel like... I feel like there's going to be some sort of... Uh, hmm... Well, I think you're unprepared. You're unprepared for some sort of information that is going to come. Um, you're going to need to time. You're going to need time to reflect on something that is had. There could be an unplanned departure, even, with that Three of Wands reversed. Somebody could be departing. Um, Ten of Wands reversed. Now that is dropping. That's, and the overall energy is the eight of wands. So that's messages going back and forth, communication, things happening really, really fast. So there's going to be some forward movement this week. Things are going to change and they're going to happen fast. Be expect, be expecting to have a lot of messages going back and forth with probably several different people. Um, Ten of wands. So the overall energy between you and whoever this person is, is being dropped somebody is being let go this burden is being dropped it's it's uh somebody is making a conscious change to uh drop something drop something that has been weighing them down dropping weight perhaps um dropping a burden i feel like you're going to be facing some challenges with an individual that has held you down, that has held you back in some way. Um, the Hermit is about going within, taking time to think about, planning your next move. You may be planning another move, okay? There could be another move that is coming up. Um, totally not prepared I feel like there's going to be a big fight. There's going to be a big argument with somebody that is super, super, super stubborn that is in your circle. This person is unwilling to budge. This person is very, very headstrong. Um, I feel like you're not on the same page with this person. You're not. You're not. And somebody's not seeing something. There's lack of foresight. 
There's lack of foresight, but something is going to be shown with that hermit card. There's a period of enlightenment that is coming. Somebody is about to be enlightened. The main challenge between you and another person is, is this hermit card, which is time. It's enlightenment. It's a need to reflect and on the changes that are happening. There is some changes that are happening this week. I wonder if it has to do with a relocation. Now, it could have something to do with a job or a home or something like that because I consider that Seven of Pentacles a relocation. Sudden, I feel like it's sudden change. Two of Swords reversed is something being revealed to you. I feel like you are definitely going to be guarded. You may have your guard up. You may be wanting to protect yourself. You may be feeling disappointed. You may have a lot of fears, anxiety, stress, or worries this week. Worries over some sort of investment. So yeah, I feel like that's what's on the table here. I feel like, you know, you're going to be going through some sort of emotional turmoil over, I don't know, some sort of investment. But I feel like whoever you're dealing with is is well there it feels like somebody is opening up because the four of pentacles is like giving away something to do with money um finding a solution i think we have somebody here that is trying to find a solution to a problem but they're struggling i think it's the other person somebody is trying to find a solution but because of financial issues, they're struggling to do so. I do definitely see a struggle here. Somebody is burned out. They are overwhelmed. And I feel like they're trying to find a solution, but they're overdoing it in some way. I also feel like you are dealing with a self-centered individual who is uh, unstable, perhaps, you know. There could be, we could have somebody here that is hoarding. They're hoarding possessions, you know. They're very, very selfish. I, it's very crazy. I feel like you're dealing with a very selfish individual who is causing you problems. And the main challenge is planning. You need to, you're going to need time to plan. You need to plan. You need to you need to work together. And I feel like the the problem is working together with this person. Perhaps you need time to reflect on some sort of change this week that is happening. I mean, with that Two of Swords, that Two of Swords reversed, I feel like there's something that is being exposed that is going to overwhelm you. And you're going to need time to reflect on whatever this is. Okay, this is another person that has their mind made up and you can't change their mind and that's probably what is what is happening here. I think that that you're dealing with somebody that is overly materialistic. Okay, this person is overly materialistic and they're fighting they're fighting something they're it feels like they're fighting there's no emotions here this is person is emotionless they're, they're they're not acting on emotions they're in a situation that is based on materialism and i know that's it's hard to explain it's very hard to explain but anyway um the advice that i have is to surrender this is your advice card surrender just just let it go you're on the path you're as soon as you let go of the need to carry this burden or to carry this weight or to hold on to whatever this is you're going to feel relief i feel relief a couple times here there's relief with acceptance accept what is you know whatever that, whatever that means this is freeing yourself making a conscious change headed towards balance okay planning a move you may be you may be in the process of planning a move it's very unexpected unprepared unprepared for a move so something is happening i feel like you are going to be receiving some sort of information or messages in regards to a move and this could be job related could be home related could be somebody that you're dealing with that is moving they're taking everything with them you know all the possessions you know everything this is somebody that is very selfish I don't know what that means for you, but I feel like there is somebody here that is extremely selfish that is really going to piss you off. Um, 
Yeah, so I feel like this week you're going to be going back and forth, receiving messages and news in regards to a person that is really going to, I feel like it's going to put you on edge. I feel like it's going to force you to go within, to think about your next move. That you're going to be letting go of something that has held you back for some time. Um, or they're going to be letting go of you, one or the other. Um, very dissatisfied with an outcome. You are not going to be happy with something. That's all there is to it. I mean, it's it's very clear. This is a painful, stressful change of some sort that is coming your way. It feels like there's somebody that is going to pick a fight with you. You know, they're fighting with you. Um, they're very jealous. Um, very money hungry as well. You are definitely, definitely, definitely going to need to go within to release, to let go. You're going to be letting go of something. That's all there is to it. It's something that has been very burdensome to you. It's not going to be easy. You're going to be shown the way. You're going to be the shown. You are going to be shown the way to let go of whatever this is. Okay. You're going to be, this is, this is going through some sort of awakening. You're going to be going through some sort of spiritual awakening. This whole situation is, um, enlightening you, put it that way. Um, it's, you totally did not see this coming. I hope you're ready for a change because things are about to change. And they're going to change fast from here on out. Things are going to happen fast. So anyway, Libra, I feel like... Uh, you could even be experiencing some financial issues this this week, you know, some financial setbacks. I mean, I hate to say that, but that could certainly be the case. Somebody could even be after your job. Protect your assets, protect your investments, okay? Because you got somebody here that is is after you and that's what I got to say totally unprepared to see something you're not prepared but you are about to see something you are about to see it's almost like somebody's true colors you're about to be awakened put it that way this is like a wake up call. Information overload. Good luck. 